Okay, my name is Kelly Decker, and this is my audience for my movie review speech. So, for my speech, I decided to do the movie Fury, directed by David Ayer. Um, if you ever want to know what it feels like to be in Germany in the 1940s, Fury is the movie to watch. Um, it's a true story about a sergeant that takes five men into enemy territory, and he has a, he's, he's been through war several times, but he does have a young soldier that doesn't really know what he's doing, and it makes life questionable. So a summary of the film, Don Kohler, which is the sergeant, he's been through a lot of brutal fights and he's really worn in and very tough and brutal. Norman Ellison, which is a young, inexperienced soldier, he has a hard time in the battlefield. It's hard for him to shoot people and kill people to protect his crew because he feels like it's wrong. Um, it's the sergeant's job to make sure that all his soldiers make it out, but with Norman, it makes it hard and he really questions if they'll be able to come out alive. The theme of this movie is that war is tragic. It's brutal and hard to recover from. It makes a different mindset to fight, or it takes a different mindset to fight in battle. Um, another theme is that they are bl blood brothers. Um, they, they were complete strangers, and then war brought them together, and they decided to depend on each other for their lives, and they learned to trust each other. The last theme of this movie is the good and bad human nature. Some soldiers become animals, and others still have their decency, but it's really hard to recover from this when you come home because they have to it's live or die. The director, David Ayer, is best known for his crime films based in Los Angeles, California. However, he was not always in the movie industry. His film, U-571, was based off his time on the submarine in the U.S. Navy. Uh, his debut film was Harsh Times, and he went on to direct uh, the film Street Kings of Harsh Times. Some fun facts about the movie uh, Fury is the film features Tiger 131 from the UK's Wilmington Tank Museum, the only functioning Tiger 1 tank in the world. Um, when, the, when the tanks are about to enter the village, a scene in the movie, one unknown tank drives over a crushed body. This scene was from a real World War II picture, showing the same scene. The film was shot in 62 days and had a gross total of $85.8 million just in the United States. Overall, the film has had many different themes, including the war is tragic. It can turn soldiers into brothers, even though they're complete strangers, and shows the good and the bad of the human nature. The film really pulls the audience in and tugs on their heartstrings, and they, it shows them what it was like to be at war in World War II. Um, it's not a lot. It's just the tiniest bit of horror and disgust that they could ever go through, but it really is hard to watch but it makes you appreciate what they do for you every day and then as well.